welcome to Storytime at Home with the Livermore Public Library. My name is Miss Caitlin, and today we are going to use our shakers in the songs towards the end of story time. So please grab a shaker or a rattle for those songs. Welcome, friends. Let's begin today by doing bread and butter. We're going to keep our steady rhythm as we do this chant together. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as quiet as we can. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as loud as we can. Hello! Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as low as we can. Hello! Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as high as we can. Hello! Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as fast as we can. Oh. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say hello as slow as we can. Hello. <laughs> wow, that was very slow. Good job. Now, we need to wake up our fingers by doing the itsy bitsy spider. It goes like this. The itsy bitsy spider climbed up the water spout. Down came the rain that washed the spider out. Out came the sun that dried up all the rain and the itsy bitsy spider climbed up the spout again. Now it's time to talk about our early learning tip of the day. Did you know finger plays and songs like the Itsy Bitsy Spider, Open Shut Them, and many others are great for helping children develop their fine motor skills. That's the ability to move your fingers in small and precise ways. <laughs> Do songs like these together throughout the day. There are many different ones to choose from, so you can practice pinching like this, opening, shutting, waving and whittling. There are so many different ways you can practice and um, your fine motor skills are so important for doing things like writing and grabbing and all sorts of good stuff. So do songs and finger plays together throughout the day. Not only is it fun, it is also beneficial. Let's sing a song to go along with our early learning tip of the day. Today we're going to do Where is Thumpkin? This is another one that's great for practicing your fine motor skills. <laughs> it goes like this. Where is Thumpkin? Where is Thumpkin? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away. Run away. Where is Pointer? Where is Pointer? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away. Run away. Where is Middleman? Where is Middleman? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away, run away. Where is Ring Man? Where is Ring Man? Here I am, here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away, run away. Where is Pinky? Where is Pinky? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away, run away. <laughs> Good job.
job. Did you notice some of the fingers were easier to use than others? Well, practice and I'm sure it'll get even easier. Let's read a book. Today we are going to read Hands Can by Cheryl Willis Hudson with photographs by John Francis Burke. This is all about what your hands can do. Hands can wave to say hello. Can you wave too? I knew you could do it. <laughs> Hands can touch things high and low. Can you put your hands up for high and down for low? Good. Hands can learn to tie a shoe. Ooh, it takes some practice, but I know you can do it. You'll be able to learn to do that eventually too. If you don't already know. Hands can say, I love you. How are their hands saying, I love you? With a hug. Hands can hold things. Hands can mold things. Being very gentle with a hamster and molding clay like Play-Doh. Hands can catch and hands can throw. The playing ball. Hands can plant seeds in a row. I planted seeds in my garden. Hopefully I'll have some peas soon. Hands can mix things. Hands can fix things. Look, he's mixing paint. They're fixing their toy truck. Hands can clap while voices sing. Oh, we know how to clap, right? You put your hands together and you clap like this. <laughs> Good. Hands can do all kinds of things. What do you do with your hands? Peekaboo! Have you played that game? Peekaboo! <laughs> can be pretty fun. Oh, let's practice our waving one more time when we say bye bye. <laughs> There we go. Lots of things that hands can do. <laughs> the end. Now it's time to sing another song. This one is called The Five Green and Speckled Frogs and it's another great one for practicing your motor skills. Again, so many different songs include hand motions, and any of them that do are great for this. So we're going to sing the five green speckled frogs by getting our five little froggies ready on their little howl lock, and it goes like this. Five green and speckled frogs sitting on a hollow log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are just four speckled frogs. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Four green and speckled frogs sitting on a hollow log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are just three speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Three green and speckled frogs sitting on a hollow log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are just two speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. 
Two green and speckled frogs sitting on a hollow log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is just one speckled frog. Ribbit. One green and speckled frog sitting on a hollow log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. She jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no more speckled frogs. Oh, we don't hear any more frogs because there are none left. <laughs> Good job counting down from five to me. Can you try that again? Five, four, three, two, and one. <laughs> Good job. Now it's time to use our shakers for the next two songs. The first shaker song we're going to do is the alphabet song. So please shake your shaker with every letter that we sing. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? <laughs> Good job. We are also going to sing Shake Your Shakers Up. Shake your shakers up. And shake your shakers down, shake your shakers dancing all around the town. Dancing on your shoulders, dancing on your head, dancing on your knees now. Tuck them into bed. <laughs> Good job shaking your shakers. So that's it for today's story time at home with the Livermore Public Library. Thank you so much for joining us. Before we go, can you practice waving with me? Oh, good. How about the other hand? Yeah. And can you open your hands? Can you close them? Can you open them? And can you wiggle them? Good. Practice moving your fingers and you'll be able to write and pinch and grab and do all of that good stuff in no time. <laughs> Let's sing one more song before we wave goodbye for the last time today. So we are going to sing Tickle the Clouds. Tickle the clouds, tickle your toes, turn around and tickle your nose. Reach down low, reach up high, story time is over. Now say goodbye. Goodbye, everybody, and I will see you next time.